Hey y'all, welcome to my channel. My name is Beverly. I do things planner related. If you're new here, welcome to the hot mess. And if you're coming back, you already know. So um, today's just midweek check-in. It's Thursday. Um, it's been a very long week and um, we're just gonna see how it's going. I did do um, a poll on my Instagram and asked y'all to help me pick between my apricot mo term and my Chic Sparrow Haze Traveler's Notebook there that I made into rings. And overwhelmingly, it was the apricot. So, um, and I think you're right. It's kind of springy and I kind of missed it. <laughs> Honest. Um, so what I did was I came in here and just decorated it a little and tried to refresh it to make it feel new. Um, so, and then every time I'm in this, I roll it, um, like once or twice. Uh, so it's just getting floppier and more lived in and it's a very floppy planner and that's what I like. I'm not a very big stiff planner person. Um, because I like it to be soft and nice to touch. So, um, anyway, so like I said, I came in here and decorated it. I'm not really using it as my wallet. I have a little wallet that I have in my purse that just carries my driver's license and my, uh, main card. And that's about it. That's about all I carry with me and some gift cards. But other than that, um, this is just an anniversary card that I put some washi tape on that I've had in my last couple. These are little, uh, post-it notes that I folded down, cut down to pocket size and put some of that Van Gogh washi on it. And, um, it's just decoration. I, you know, pockets elude me. I, it's been a thing for quite a while. I can never get like, unless I'm using them functionally, they just never turn out. Okay. Um, I did change up my dashboard. Uh, this is, uh, Randy. I'll link her down below. Um, she has some beautiful dashboards. Um, this isn't the only one that comes in this bundle. They're very reasonably priced. They, they're, sorry, my Alexa went off and it was announcing an appointment I have. So, um, Anyways, this is uh, Randy, and I, like I said, I'll, I'll link her down below. She has a YouTube, she's on Insta, she has a beautiful blue Gilio um, and some other gorgeous planners. Anyway, she makes these dashboards, they're on Etsy, um, and she makes a little pack every, and this is the April one, uh, Farm Fresh with the eggs, it just kind of reminds me of home. Uh, we always had chickens, and I always collected eggs um, since I was little bitty. And um, so that always reminds me of spring. Um, just Lauren Phelps Designs card and some page flags, my uh, Disney Flower and Garden Festival pin. So just a little bit of decoration. Um, I was just trying, like I said, I was trying to make it fresher, trying to spoosh it up a little bit for myself and make it a little different. So. Um, I can go, today's Thursday, so I'll just go ahead and mark it off. That way I don't have to come back and do it. Um, I did change this up. This is Watch Becca Plans. This is her weekly tracker. It's Monday through Friday. I'm using this, um, to track my annual leave and my sick leave when I take off work. Um, I had to take off today for an appointment, uh, early. So, um, but, like... So I keep a list of that um, over here, kind of written out. I was, and then I was keeping a yearly overview from Plan With B. Here it is. Um, and I just couldn't see the, it was hard for me to see the numbers. I'm very sight impaired. So um, I just, I just decided not to use that anymore. And I took out all my stuff that, um, had this on the back I realized that I had a bunch of that in here and I want to keep my inserts that are going to be functional and that I'm going to keep like this for all year um I went in and already marked out like it's color coded so like beige is holidays that are paid and then blue is for AL that 
or my leave that's like vacation leave and then green is sick leave so I can kind of look and see how that's going and this is just for work so it's only Monday through Friday that's fine um, and that's what this tracker is so um, I want to keep the stuff that I'm keeping like my this is Watch Becca Plans too. This is her yearly overview. I'm going to keep that kind of stuff kind of neutral so that as I change out my stuff, it doesn't clash or like I don't have to print out a new one. So um, this is um, Playing With Bees Holidays. I just put it on the back. Trigger lists are all the same. I did add a few extra vacation trip planners from... Um, Peanuts Planner Co. in here because I have a few more trips and these are all taken with upcoming trips. Um, I did put this on here. This is Watch Becca Plans 2 and this is You've Got Mail. It's one of my favorite movies ever, ever. Um, I watch it all the time. I love it. Um, my notes. Somebody asked me where these flowery notes were from. They're from Plan With B. They were a sticky. They were part of a... Um, wildflower bundle you can get the you get the like the pages with grid or blank with the wildflowers on it and then it also comes with stickies or maybe this was one of the ones that you bought the stickies separate than the pages I don't remember but they're the, you buy them and they're on Etsy they're not a freebie more post-it notes <laughs> that was all out of my pocket mostly and um, I just took them out of my pocket when I took it down and put them in here. And they combined with the ones I already had. And it was just like a shit ton of them. So, um, this is all to-dos and references. My reading I haven't really read. I've had a friend that had a family member on hospice. And I've been going and seeing them every day almost. Um, my watch list to be watched. I want to watch some of that. I've just been watching reruns because I haven't had the brain capacity. This was this is ham and collards. Um, I think tonight we're just going to order salads. <laughs> grocery list. Uh, that was my grocery list for this week. I can throw it away because it is done. Trigger list. I did print out some more of these too. I'm going to go through and do a freezer and pantry inventory and I'm going to put those on here. This is part of the uh, Randy's bundle so I will um, and I hope that's pronouncing her name right. I, again I will link her down below but um, this was part of that dashboard bundle for April, and I like it because it's, you know, coffee. These have been coming in clutch. They're appointment stickers, and these are from Plan With B, and these are her new ones, um, her new sticky bundle. Um, and I just printed them out on different paper, but these are like... These are like from July and August that I have appointments already scheduled. These are coming up. They're recent. Um are soon to be and um so I put those on here to uh like I can write notes as I think about them or if I have questions that I need to follow up on because some of them are like lab follow-ups med follow-ups things like that to see if meds are working but um so uh this is really coming in handy I wrote a bunch of stuff out when I went to the doctor the other day had a bunch of questions, went through them with her, you know, took notes. So these are really, these have been really good. Uh, again, plan with B and they're part of a sticky bundle that she has for sale in her Etsy shop. Mm, my grandparents. This is um, Lauren Phelps Designs. It's one of her vellums that I had gotten. And I just cut it down and put it in here. Spoke to, this was the same plan with B. I don't know if it's in the same bundle, but I bought a couple of bundles when she had a sale and I just threw them in here. I've already gone through like three or four of these. So I just write notes down and then throw them away when I'm done with them and then just replace them with more. My planner stuff, I wrote down some promo codes. Um, this was my mental health tracker for April. I'm still... Still keeping up with that and my sleep, and I'm not sleeping. This is part of her uh, the dashboard bundle too, and it's really pretty. This 
my printer ran out of ink. <laughs> this is Plan With B on the back. It looked more like Wildflower. I just didn't like anything else on the back of it. So I printed Plan With B's Wildflower, but it didn't print all the way because I'd ran out of, my ink was low, had to replace it. So, but I just left it. I didn't care enough. My adulting list, my study list, my weight trackers, workout trackers, I did go back to the gym. <laughs> um, I got this. This was from Sugar Boo at Disney. Um, it says, what good shall I do this day? thought it was cute. These are just extra notes and tracker pages. These, I don't like these. <laughs> I don't like the six-week thing. It makes the box too small. I can't take as many notes and do as much stuff. And I don't like the non-lined. I don't like them unlined, so I'm going to have to figure something else out for my monthly. I'm not enjoying these. These are Peanuts Planner Co. Even though I like most of her stuff, I don't like that it's not gridded. Um, and if the lines weren't here, if this was blank and this was blank, I would print out just a grid page on top of this. Um, but I can't, and it'll look all jacked up. But um, So i got to figure something else out. That's, I can't do that. Uh, I know it's a thing, and whatever, but I just, I can't, I can't do it. Um, so this is how my week is going. It's going. Um, I'm still keeping track of my expenses. This isn't working out anymore. I'm having to use extra budget trackers. I printed out some more, um, and I'm not liking having to switch over every week when I still have pending stuff on the week before. I didn't like that this week, so I think I'm going to just go to something else. I think I'm going to figure out something else, but it's whatever. Um, you know, that's the name of the game and rings. You can change out your stuff as much as you want. That's part of the ups and downs. <laughs> um, my daily, I have a lot of stuff I did today. Went to the doctor, did all those things. I gotta get a new debit card. Mine's fixing to expire. I didn't even notice until Amazon told me. <laughs> My dailies, they'll be fine. I've been journaling in the back on my bad days. I've been journaling, so yesterday and today. I've, um, anytime I look at my mental health tracker and I'm this side of the line, that means it's over five, my mental health. Um, I journal. I've been trying to journal um, about like my feelings and how it's making me feel. So these will all be like journal days. Um, so I stuck some extra astrology paper in the back and I'm just journaling on it um, just to try to help my mental health a little bit. This is some more of that Lauren Phelps Designs vellum I just stuck in here. These are from Journaling Home and they, I bought these. These are Brain Dump Journaling Guide for Anxiety journaling guide for overwhelm and then this one is journal prompts for discouraging days um so i just put those in front of my gratitude and then um so i can have them just as reference uh to help me like journal on those days um these are it's my financial section it's pretty cleaned up i just um, writing down some stuff I want to track on here, and then I'm just, I'm still trying to figure out what I want this to look like. Um, I don't know why I can't commit to something. It's not like I can't print it out and just redo it if I don't like it. It's my decluttering, and then these are my months in the back. Um, see, these have lines, and they're bigger boxes because they're only um, five weeks and then they scrunch them on two days but honestly what I think I'm going to do is might get another set of these redate them which is fine with me that's fine um, if I get what I want and then put like when it's when I need the extra day and it's only a couple of months I'm just going to stick it up like at the top somewhere because I like that the five day, the five week calendar is much bigger and I can fit a lot more in it. And it's lined, keeps me on track, keeps my writing down, makes my writing smaller, <laughs> forces it to go down. Um, so my memories. This is a 
noodle egg noodle um egg noodle recipe from a book from 19 I don't know 40 something Betty Crocker 1940 1950 cookbook that my grandmother made and then my uncle took over the recipe and so he sent it so I got it took a picture of it kind of wrote down some notes that he gave me pointers to make them and I'm going to start making the noodles now for holidays so um, because it is a long laborious process you have to roll them and cut them and um, dry them for a couple of days and the temperature has to be right because if it's rainy that it'll be too humid and they won't dry out so they won't cook they'll be a gooey mess so um, I'm going to try a couple of times this summer um, to kind of perfect them so I'm going to start working on those but I wrote it out wrote some notes that he gave me and um, we're going to see how it goes my granddaughters for Easter, my family for Easter, all of our trips and some notes and for June. And then there's nothing else in the back. And then this is what my back pocket looks like. This is just a card I got with a Lauren Phelps design order. These are stickers I got from this. I got from a shop here, at, at, I think in St. Augustine. This is from the Flower and Garden Festival. It's got a little orange bird on it. And this is a Starbucks tulip card all right so that's how it's going um yeah that's kind of how it's going it's not much it's the same crap every day I hate to um I hate to like repeat myself but that's kind of how it goes it's every week so Today, what I'll do is I'll go and put all the stuff I've already done back on Thursday. So, this will go to Sunday because I want to make a, a new YouTube on Sunday. I did my husband's. It says work laundry. That's his uniforms. Um, I'm not decluttering today. I just, I, I don't have it in me. Recycling. I'm going to read a little bit, I think, and rest um and these kind of sit here so these are don't forget my meds because i need the daily reminder apparently because i've been forgetting um night meals to do so any preps i need to make for dinner um it's kind of been sitting there and my recycling that's a today thing because my recycling runs tomorrow gratitude and plan that's for me to gratitude and plan every night and then the daily shopping is to catch up my spending so those four kind of sit there um, they just serve as reminders. I don't want to write it every day. Um, so there's that. Sorry, it's getting a little dark because it's in the afternoon. So, um, but, uh, so I hope the lighting's not too bad. But anyway, so I'll go in tonight when I gratitude and plan and put everything for Friday onto my dailies. And then write down anything that um, I need to do. I already have some stuff written, like I need to pack. We're going out of town on Saturday. Um, yeah, oh, the linen and lace collab with JC Creative and KB Plans. I'm jumping on that at noon. Oh, let me write it at 12, at 11. It's 11. I think she's doing her dashboards at 11 and then her linen and lace um, like little holder things, the pin holder things at like noon or something so I want to get I'm going to be sure because I am definitely like a neutral girl <laughs> so the linen and the lace will be great because uh, I wanted one but I'm, I'm not I'm, I have a real hard time committing to color so um, especially something like that I'm just a practical person so for me it's hard to you know commit to like something that can only be used in certain situations <laughs> kind of like why I have a capsule wardrobe because um I have a hard time committing <laughs> to those kind of things to have like outfits or get-ups um but anyway that's not the point um so that's how my week is going it's been a long week I'm tired y'all I'm going to bed early um I'm gonna lay down and um hope for a better day tomorrow hope to be rested tomorrow <laughs> all right so if y'all have any questions put them down below 
Um, if you like this kind of thing, give me a thumbs up. If you want to stick around and see how it works out, subscribe, hang out. Um, I love having y'all and I love chatting with y'all in the comments. And um, until next time, y'all, bye.